Tonight we're learning more about an accident that took the life of a mother and her eight-year-old child on Thanksgiving night. Four other siblings in the car were also severely injured in the crash. News 13's Madeline Beerster tells us how the community is dealing with this tragedy. It's just such a, a horrible time. Around 1030 Thursday night, a mother and her children were headed home along Lucas Lake Road when she was unable to make the right turn on the road causing her vehicle to crash into a tree, according to the Florida Highway Patrol. Reports say the SUV was carrying a total of six people. I think there are two that are still hospitalized. One horribly, unfortunately, passed away, and then the mother passed away. Family members say the six-year-old girl and 11-year-old boy have been transported to Pensacola for their critical injuries. The two other siblings, a 14-year-old boy and a 13-year-old girl, were recently picked up from the hospital and will recover alongside their extended family. Superintendent of Schools Joe Taylor says the district will provide counseling as all five children attend school in Washington County. We have two licensed mental health workers that work within the district themselves. And so we have availed those two, including to the community, plus any of our guidance counselors and other counselors that we have that work for us back to the schools that are involved. Taylor says students shouldn't be afraid to reach out for help. If there are needs, and if you will reach out to us, you can reach out to the schools, you can reach out to anyone, uh, we'll respond. We, we'll do what we need to do. In Washington County, Madeline Bierster, News 13, Panhandle Strong.